Good morning. Would you like a true drag and drop block for Gutenberg? So I need your help today. We have part developed a drag and drop block for Gutenberg. So I'm going to show you how it works. If you like it, let me know in the comments below and we'll probably develop it and release it as a product. It's more of a proof of concept at the moment, but let me know what you think. Let's get into the demo. Okay, here's a sneak peek on how it works. I'm going to add the block into the page by searching for designer canvas. Now essentially what we do here is we set a canvas where you can put Gutenberg blocks anywhere you like within that canvas. So you've got complete pixel level control to drag and drop blocks anywhere you like within the canvas that we set. You can change the height and the width of the canvas as well. This is how it works. You add your design element and then you can add any block you like within that box like so. And that box becomes draggable within the canvas. How cool is that? But you can add other blocks within that canvas, any blocks you like. So let me add an image block into this one here. So I can resize that block and then I can simply pick it up and drag it wherever I like within that particular canvas. As I said, you can change the background color of canvases just by clicking here. You can also overlap blocks like this. There are two levels essentially to how this works. You'll see over in the list view here, we've got the top level designer canvas. And then within that, we've got designer elements. Now the designer canvas has some settings. I'm just going to show you the basic ones over here on the right. So over here you can change the background color and image. You can set the image position. You can also set the background color and have a gradient color. You can also set the background color opacity. And in layout here you can set the layout. You've got a few options over here. So normal, full width background and full width content. And then each designer element also has a whole bunch of options again in the block settings panel. I won't go through all of these, just some of the more interesting ones. So each one can have a background, background color, and you can also set effects. These are quite funky. So you can have all these different effects on each designer element, remember. And uh, let me close that down. And also you can change the layout of each of these. So you could say, I want this overlapping in this example up here. You see how this is now overlapping. And that's just the Z index option here. You've also got this option free flow, which I won't talk too much about today, but this gives you absolute positioning on each of the content designer elements. That's for another day though. And then you can also change your tablet layout and mobile layout down here as well. So we've built a whole bunch of options into this canvas layout. So our proof of concept has actually gone quite a long way. This is a tricky thing to build and there are some bugs, but let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you think this would be useful for you? If we finish building this, would you use it? Who do you think would be a perfect user for something like this? Maybe somebody that's just come to WordPress and knows nothing about it, or maybe a designer who wants something equivalent to using InDesign or Photoshop where you can just drag and drop elements on the page. Or am I completely wasting my time and my money and I should just scrap the project tomorrow? Whatever you think, let me know in the comments below. It would be incredibly helpful to me to get your feedback. So please, please, please do. Also, if you enjoyed this video, please could you hit that like button now because it really, really, really helps spread the word of the channel. And every time you do hit that like button, our cats, Get a little treat. So thanks again for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button below and you'll be notified every time I release a new one. Keep well and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.